In today's video, we're diving into the new version of this cutting edge tool. This tool can help you craft cinematic masterpieces from storyboarding to the final cut using nothing but your creativity and the power of AI. Whether you're a content creator that makes viral shorts or a filmmaker, this update opens up endless possibilities for bringing your visions to life. And it is open source. It can also now help you create your own AI effect like AI hug, AI muscle, and a whole lot more. In this video, we'll dive into these upgrades and a whole lot more. So don't forget to like and subscribe for more AI content like this, and let's get into it. Okay, so you can just go to your browser or to your search engine and search for this. Now, the name of this tool we're going to be using today is called Sky Reels. So you can just search for it. The link would be in the description. Now, you can just click on this first link. So this new Sky Reels is entirely open source and has infinite video generation with AI, which can be used for short films or even whole full length movies. So as you can see here, once you click on it, you should be presented with this interface. As you can see here, these are like the two main features, AI video and AI drama. So if we scroll down, these are my creations. Then as you can see here, this is Sky Reels V2 and it's open source with infinite video generation. Uh, yeah, so these are some of the examples of what people have done. And let's take a look at some of them. Let's say this one first. What's wrong? You look like you have something important to say. Actually, I've always wanted to tell you. I finally got up the courage to say it out loud. I love you, and I want you to know how much you mean to me. Be my girlfriend. If it's difficult, you don't have to answer me. No, I do. I hope to be with you, not just on a whim. As we saw, that was amazing. They have really done a lot with this V2, because that was amazing. So let's take a look at another one. Let's say this one. Wow, this hair is too messy. I need to get a haircut. I can become handsome. Excuse me, is anyone there? I need a haircut. Hi, help me get a cool hairstyle. Welcome, do you have a hairstyle or reference picture you want? Wow, that was actually really cool. Instead of going through the hassle of doing stop motion animations, this could actually help you a lot. So let's take a look at another one. Let's see this. For centuries, humans believed that giants were just myths, but they were wrong. At this remote archaeological site, our team unearthed a skeleton of a gigantic size far beyond the reach of modern humans. For centuries, humans believed that... That was nice. These are all really amazing. So it just shows you what you can do with this tool. And again, to note, you can generate infinite length AI videos with this for short films or even full length movies or your own viral reels. So let's take a look at something a bit shorter, like this is of a robot mechanic. Oh, that's nice. Realistic as always. And there's a whole lot of videos being generated by the community. Uh, let's take a look at another one. Let's see this. Evacuate! Everyone evacuate immediately! I repeat, this is not a drill. The building is exploding! Evacuate! It was horrible. The fire was out of control like an untamed beast. That's really amazing. So let's get to it and start testing it out. First of all, let's test the video generation and see how better it is. So these are my creations, and as you can see, there's this effects feature, which is basically the AI effects, like AI muscles, hug cartoon characters, hug your idol, AI kiss, AI hug, and this shake feature. So we're just going to be using um, the text to video, so let's give it a prompt like this. So as you can see here, we can add images of the first and last frame, which is cool. And over here, we can do a subject reference in which we upload one to four images and also describe it for more consistency. Then over here, we can upload a video and ask it to extend the video. 
And then there's a lip sync feature in which we upload a video and type what we want the character to say, which is also really cool. Let's test the text to video first. And as we can see over here, we can go up to 30 seconds of video and let's select this. The model here, we can just leave it at auto mode and 16 by nine aspect ratio and click on create and let's see how it does. And as you can see, it's done. And let's see what it cooked for us. And wow, it looks so realistic. The physics of the water, the reflections, the sun, the lighting, everything looks really, really amazing. So yeah, over here, we can either edit it or download it or share it to our various platforms. So let's just download it over here. And yeah, so let's try another prompt. And we have this prompt here. Leave it at five seconds, aspect ratio 16 by nine and click on create and it's done. So let's take a look at what it cooked for us. And that was nice. The slow zoom shot, the fire, everything about this is just perfect. And yeah, we can go ahead and download that. So now let's test out the image to video feature. Of course, we'll go over here to generate image. Uh, there's this new AI write feature in which you can come here and describe your prompt and the AI would help you um, modify it and create a more detailed prompt. So first of all, let's generate an image from just a prompt. Let's say something like this something like this. Then over here, aspect ratio left at 16 by nine. The image model left at auto mode. The style, as you can see, there are different styles you can choose from, but we can just leave it that realistic and then hit generate and see what it does with that. And as we can see, it's done. And let's take a look at them. So this is the first one. That's nice. And wow, these look really nice and consistent, like they're really, really, really consistent, which is cool. So yeah, over here, we can just download it. Well, let's download this one. Then over here, you can send it to video immediately. Then you can upskill it, regenerate it, edit it, and expand. So let's try to generate another image. But this time, let's use AI right. Let's say something like, and yeah, we can leave that. So once you click on this, it will modify the prompt for us and it's done with that and we can just hit generate here and see what it cooks so it's done and let's see what it generated for us and wow i really see how it has gotten better these look amazing so yeah let's download this image and use this specific one to test out the image to video feature so let's go to generate video then click on this to add a first frame now we could crop it or zoom in but we'll leave it at this and just click crop and then we can put in the prompts like this and click on create and it's done. So let's see what it cooked. And boy oh boy, it is amazing. No morphing, it's just perfect. This is really nice. Then let's move on to the feature that you've all been waiting for. Well, first of all, I just want to shed light on this. This is the train effects, which is new. So you can upload different files with the similar visual style and basically make your own effects. The effects like this AI muscle, um, this one, AI hug, and a whole lot more. So you can also basically make your own effect. And that's really cool. Uh, yeah, let's move on to the feature that you've all been waiting for, which is the generate drama feature. So yeah, once you click on it, you should be presented with this. And as you can see here, you can either use these inspirations, and there are a lot of them, a lot of them, or you could let's say upload a script, or upload a novel, an entire novel, which is really cool. But yeah, we'll go with the inspirations. Let's see, let's use this. Click on confirm, and then click on generate scripts. So let's move on to the next. And over here, it is generating the scripts for this. The inspiration is over here, and it's currently generating the scripts that we use for the short story. So as we can see, the script has generated, this is basically the summary of the uh, first episode. So this is a five episode series, 
which just shows you how insane this tool is. Then over here, we can regenerate it, but we'll leave it at that and just move on to the next step and click on generate character. And the characters are generated and they look really nice. So as you can see over here, we can change the look of the characters. We can basically describe new facial features and styling, or we can just, um, import our own character. Well, yeah, and we can also create an entirely new character, which is cool. So let's move on and click on generate storyboard. And so as we can see here, it has generated all the scenes, all three scenes, which is really, really cool. So yeah, over here, we can preview or one-click video to convert it to a video. Then here, we can edit it or just convert this line into a video. So let's click on this and look at how the first scene is. And yeah, it's done generating the first scene. So let's preview that. Stop right there, thief! Where's Madame Dupont's bracelet? I haven't touched any jewelry, Ms. Leclerc. Check her apron. She's always lurking near expensive things. I'm not afraid to show you. I have nothing to hide. Of course, the waitress plays innocent. How typical. I work hard for everything I have. I don't need to steal. Security! This one's been acting suspicious for weeks! And that was nice. It just had some few morphings, but that can be fixed by regenerating the specific lines. But yeah, so as you can see over here, you can edit. You can either remove the characters, create a new one, or rewrite the scene. Give it a prompt to generate a new video for this scene. Or yeah, even make it a monologue instead of a dialogue. This version 2 just showed how better it is at a lot of things, which is nice. And it's also open source, so that's cool. And that's it for this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more AI content like this, and I'll catch you in the next one.